Okay, um, so I'm going to keep these um, these closing remarks as brief as we can because I know that you're all itching to get to the wine reception. Um, but um, first and foremost, we we do need to say some uh, thank yous. Um, most obviously, uh, of course, thank you to all of our speakers who have delivered such a, a, a wonderful range of, of papers today. Um, secondly, um, of course, thanks to um, all of the team uh, here uh, at the Society of Antiquaries who have made this event um, possible, um, but, but particularly to, to those of us who are actually present uh, today. So of course, to, um, to Dr. John Cooper, um, to Danielle and Rebecca, who have been diligently working to, uh, to keep the IT running and um, pass the microphones round um, for our uh, speakers, um, to Rebecca, uh, Stephen, Matthew, um, Becky, um, who have all been working um, behind the scenes as well to uh, to provide the refreshments, to, to look after the front door, um, to um, put on the exhibition uh, upstairs, which um, I know we've, we've all very much enjoyed. Um, and of course, thank you um, to you, uh, our audience, um, both here uh, in person at Burlington House, um, and those of you um, joining us online uh, as well. Uh, I gather we've had quite a good turnout um, online and, you know, it's obviously so sad for us as, um, you know, as organisers and speakers that we can't actually um, see your faces, but um, it's lovely to know that you are out there um, and we've really appreci appreciated your engagement in um, asking questions uh, and so forth. So we do hope that you've enjoyed this event uh, as much as we have. Um, of course, uh, on a personal level, I'd like to thank my um, co-organizers, um, Laura and uh, Jen, um, without whom, uh, uh, of course, none of this uh, would have been possible. Um, as I say, I'm, I'm not going to, to give a long speech about the, uh, the content of the papers because, um, Frankly, I, I, I'm not really sure it's necessary. You know, you all saw what a what a wonderful range of uh, of papers and what a range of topics we've dealt with today. Um, but just by way of uh, a closing thought, I'm going to come back to those three words that John opened uh, this this uh, event with today. Um, that uh, that idea of political culture um, extending. Uh, decentering and broadening uh, our understanding um, of political culture um, within these islands. You know, we, we have certainly seen that um, in terms of extending to, to people outside the sphere of the court. Um, we've seen all kinds of um, different people. Um, it's, it's been uh, particularly noticeable how many uh, of the papers have dealt um, with the role of, of women in politics, whether that's um, royal women or um, hostesses, um, or even just as consumers of uh, ceramics, um, people at all levels of society uh, engaging with politics in, in so many different uh, ways. And again, that um, idea of uh, descended politics, whether that's the um, the, the Gaelic um, lords uh, in Ireland um, sort of uh, struggling to, to, to assert themselves um, against um, the, the English domination of Ireland uh, at that time, um, whether that's the role of local officials uh, like sheriffs. Um, again, I'm, I'm not gonna try and cover the, the, the complete list of papers, but we've, we've seen so many different examples. Um, and really, I, I think it's, it's hardly necessary for, for, for me to elaborate on how we've, um, you know, broadened research materials. Uh, I think that was particularly apparent in that last panel, um, that idea of, of bringing in different kinds of sources, whether that's dance, um, ceramics, pamphlets, um, 
all kinds of things that, that, that maybe haven't been as prominent um, in historical discourse um, as they should have been. And hopefully uh, events like this today will bring those kind of materials uh, front and center. Um, Jen, Laura, do you have any, anything to add at this stage? No, I think you've covered it all, Mari. So thanks to you as well. And uh, we hope everyone's enjoyed the day. And thanks to the society for, for, for um, advocating for these sort of early career events, because we've definitely missed them over the last few years, haven't we? So, um, on that note, there is a, a survey on the back of your um, programme. So if you wouldn't mind maybe just taking a minute or two to very quickly fill it out. I know that feedback is always very useful moving forwards. Um, and yet, while the closing comments have been cut short anyway, you've got all this extra time. <laughs> so, yes, but thank you everyone. It really enjoyed it. Yes, thank you very much indeed.